Hey, what's going on everybody? So this time around we're gonna show you symbol art. This is what I use to let people know when I die. So first off you go to the cogs again and you just go to symbol art. Hit A on it. On the first one you go to edit. Now I am not that good at this so I'm just gonna make up a simple one. Uh, here we got when you hit, put a piece in uh, on the actual display which is the big black box with the checker stuff on it you have uh, the six circles showing you the borders of said uh, outline of whatever object you just put in and the one at the top is the rotation point that tells you which way is top. Now, when you hit A on said object, you have a couple commands. So you have move, size, rotation, skew, color, adjust uh, transparency, reflect, so left or right, S sort. You can either move it up or down a layer. Uh, some things have motion to it. I haven't figured that part out yet. You can copy, paste, duplicate. You can change the part from the mis this menu, add a part above that one, show, hide, delete, copy the color, and apply the color. And that's really important whenever you go to color here and it brings up the color wheel, you can really have some fun with this. So I can make this really hot pink. And you just come down and confirm it. Now we're going to go to size, make it a little bit bigger. I'm gonna add part. Uh, add this in. Make that big. So we're gonna move it down one. Like this color, like uh, purple. I like that. And then all we're gonna do now is add letters. And I'm gonna put it like here. And I'm gonna come up. This is the cool part. I can just go duplicate, move, so it, you don't change the height or anything. And just come down to miscellaneous, change parts, and then just move it again, and duplicate that, move that, you can hear all the button presses and everything I'm doing I know, so that just tells you like, this is a little complicated, but it really is nice to have, so if you're playing with people without, uh, keyboard and mouse, or not keyboard mouse, without a microphone, or you're not using a microphone, this can really help out a lot. So I'm going to go to duplicate, put that down, and duplicate one more time, move it to the left, and move the miscellaneous, change part, and and there you go. I just hit override and save. You can give it a name, confirm it. And now, this is what it does. That's what my thing looks like. Nothing fancy, but here's the cool part. If you want to add that into an auto chat, just come in here to auto chat, figure out where you want it. I want it on an incapacitate. All you do is slash symbol. So slash symbol is your art, and then you need a number to tell you which one it was. Since it was number one, we go one. And now, whenever I die, it'll launch that symbol. Pretty cool, pretty simple, and you can do a lot of things with the artwork in here. Like, I've seen uh, Majin Vegeta created up, I've seen Sonic, other things like that. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. Don't forget to like, comment, share. Let me know if there's any other kind of new things you would like to see and what it is you're having a little bit of trouble with that I can try to explain in the best of my knowledge. I don't know everything with this game, 
nowhere near everything with this game. But I'm learning as I'm playing, and I'm making these videos to help out newer players, so hopefully this kind of stuff helps out. Uh, you can mix the symbol art that I just showed you with some of the chat commands uh, from the last video and mix them together. So, if I wanted to, I can go to chat settings in here, and in one of these I can add the symbol to it instead of having the camera on me it'll show the symbol but you know you still do uh slash togi t-o-g-e or uh i think it's slash m-o-y-a i believe it is depending on how do you want it uh softing softer touch or a harder touch to get people's attention and your symbol will appear there instead of your face and then the message will appear with it so it's kind of cool things to think about and just know. So, anyway, don't forget to like, comment, share, and have a wonderful night. Thank you guys for watching.